up guys? I hope you all are having an awesome morning or afternoon when you're watching this. There's nothing like the sound of a straight pipe V8 to wake you up in the morning. I mean, come on, come on. So I actually have to go run this morning. I don't know about y'all, but I really don't like running. Like I, it's not my thing. I gotta go do it though. There's gonna be more on that like soon. So one week from the day, I will be participating in the David Goggins 4x4x48. Uh, if you don't know what that is, it's uh, I would say a race, kinda, four miles every four hours for 48 hours. So yeah, it's gonna be uh, interesting. Uh, running, running's not my thing. I figured if I'm gonna be putting myself through this torture, I might as well make it worth something. So I'm very excited to announce that I've partnered with Wheels and Warriors and the Save a Warrior Foundation to raise money to combat veteran and first responder suicide. The Save a Warrior Foundation hosts integrated intensive retreats that really change the way that these veterans and first responders live their lives. And get this guys, we are already at $1,215 donated to the organization. The goal is $1,500. So by the time this video goes live, there's a little bit less than a week, but with you guys' help, I know we can hit $1,500. We can do this guys. If you'd like to donate, it would mean so much to me and so much to the Save a Warrior Foundation. There's a link down in the description. Hit that link. It'll take you over to the Facebook fundraiser and you can donate any amount helps, $1, hundred dollars anything you can do makes a huge impact but now I guess I actually have to run 48 miles is a lot <laughs> I'm not ready for it one mile it's number two it's three miles boys Did I mentioned I hate running so I do the weighted runs because at least in my mind I think it's gonna be easier when I take the weight off to do the actual 48 I think it's gonna be easier. Maybe it's not. If it's not, uh, let me know in the comments so I'll stop doing that. But I am, yeah, I'm sweaty. It makes it look like I have. Anyway, today I think we're gonna be taking the Mustang kind of on its first little road trip. It's gonna be about an hour drive. Never done it before, so we'll see. I'm kind of nervous, but she's been running pretty good lately, knock on wood, so I think maybe, just maybe, she can do it. I hope so. Also, look at the fog today. That's crazy. So it's not that I don't trust the car. Well, I, it kind of is. I just, I, you know, I just be safe. I think these two will do it. So we just had to fill up with gas again. This time we're gonna kind of see what kind of gas mileage we can get. I, if it's double digits, I'm gonna be honest. Double digits, I'm gonna be happy because I don't think it is. Let me know in the comments below, guys. Do you think the Mustang is gonna make it? So it's like a 50 to 60 mile trip. There, so there and back, so it's gonna be like 100, 120 miles. I'm nervous. I hope it doesn't, I really do, but I'm nervous. But let me know what you think. And hopefully it's on the bright side. So we're cruising at the speed limit. This is gonna be a long, long, loud drive. It's very, very loud. I'll tell you what guys, if we were having a competition for the worst drone, So let's go, I guess. That's good, but uh, 20 miles, that's all we got, 20 miles. All right, boys, let's go.
75. Speed limit 75. So we're good. Well, boys, it made it. If you uh, if you were one of the people who said it wasn't gonna make it, I'm sorry you're wrong. But if you said it was, thank you for the support. But we are here in Gulfwake, Texas. Beautiful, awesome town. So I'm gonna go eat lunch, and then I guess we gotta drive back. I'm fat, I'm happy, and good news, it started again. That's what I'm talking about. I was a little bit concerned, if I'm honest. Thankfully, it started. Hopefully, we make it all the way back now. It actually started pretty easy this time, which is a nice change. Before I left, I wanted to stop by. There's a really cool old service station over here in Goldthwait. It's kind of abandoned. That'd be a good place to like, take a picture. I don't know. I'm really hoping the Mustang makes it back. It seems to be doing pretty good, knock on wood. I think we might make one or two stops, though, but... Overall, so far, it's been very nice. All right, I'll take it. Let's go. Just listen to it, guys. It's third gear and 2,500 RPM. Oh, oh. There's a little tunnel. I need to find an overpass bad, boys. Here we go, boys. So I pulled off, I'm in pretty Texas right now. I just pulled off on the side of the road. There's all these cool tractors and stuff lined up over here. I don't know what it is. I just like everything with wheels or a motor. It sounds good. I love tractors. Bunch of old John Deere's. There's even a Ford down there. Look at that thing. I would love to have a Ford tractor. It's on the bucket list to have a Ford tractor one day, someday. Look at all these cool old trucks too. That's so cool. One day, someday boys, but for now, uh, let's go ahead and get back. I just made it to the gas station. We're gonna fill it up We're gonna see how good well how bad the fuel economy was so you see our trip was 131 miles About half a tank It's not looking good In the comments below guess what you think it's gonna be I'm gonna say nine I hope. I think nine might be optimistic. We'll see. I'm gonna say nine. Let me know what you think though. 130 miles, about half a tank. I think it's a 16 gallon tank. Could be wrong though. We'll see. Six? Six gallons? Almost seven. We'll see. We'll do the math. So 131 divided by 6.8. No. There's no way. There's That can't. No. Let's just see. Is that real? I mean, y'all see that? 6.8 gallons. Nine? What? 19? That can't, that can't be right. <laughs> yeah. Didn't fill up all the way. So, let's fill it up some more. I'm really confused right now because it, it was full. It took an extra two tenths of a gallon. What? 131. Full tank of gas. One more time. Let's try this. 131. So divided by 7. 19. How does a 190,000 mile Mustang GT that's straight piped get 19 miles to the gallon? I'm absolutely blown away. Blown away. I think I might have found the problem we've been having with it holding RPMs. So if you look, there's the throttle body. This is the throttle cable. First off, notice anything? Pull this back, see all that slack in there? I am no uh, certified mechanic. I'm pretty sure that's not quite correct though. So Price, what do you think about the whole 20 miles to the gallon thing? I'm kind of shocked. You shocked Dude, we too? Gotta, we got it, I don't know, it may be a fluke, so we gotta do it again. Yeah, yeah well, so next weekend when we're doing the, uh, when I'm doing the run and I have two car shows to go to, we are taking the Mustang, as of now. We're taking the Mustang and the truck. Maybe. Then we'll kind of get a, a real test of if it's a legit 20 miles to the gallon. With that good news, uh, this video is effectively over. Don't forget, there's a link in the bio to donate to the Save a Warrior Foundation. We are so close. We are at $1,215. I donated. Did you donate? 10 bucks. He did. We, we're at $25 together, dude. We're, we're making it happen. We're on a college budget. We're doing the best we can. But I really appreciate all the donations. A week from today, I'm going to be killing myself running 48 miles and going to car shows. So y'all stay tuned. I'm gonna film a little bit. So I just noticed these are eight spoke wheels. They have eight LUTs. Truck swap.
So we're gonna ignore that. And just, so they're they're not. I guess it's not specific for this car. It just has many different bolt patterns. I wonder. I don't think that would fit the truck. No. Can you imagine the, the that? Would be too big. Can you imagine those little things? You know how much power we'd be making. Dude, those tires would be gone like that. Oh, dude gone anyway though make sure you click that link to donate i really appreciate each and every one of you that does every little bit helps we're gonna help combat veteran and first responder suicide and it's a great cause but until next time y'all make sure take it easy keep on crushing it and i will catch y'all in the next video